Hey, 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 welcome back, y'all. Welcome back to the Nut House and Nails. Thank you so very much for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. And anybody that's new out there, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Come on over here and give me some loving. Give me some of that loving, girl. You hit that subscribe button and come and join this crazy nutty circle over here. All right, just want to put this out there and forewarn you before you do. All right, if you're not used to someone with a silly, goofy, crazy sense of humor, you might not want to watch me. You might not want to watch me because over here, it's all we do is just get crazy. That's why I tell you, pull your straight jackets out and your nail brushes and hands because, hey, things can get crazy over here, all right? But only in a good way. That's why I call it the Nut House and Nails. We don't go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs for real, for real. You know, we just get a little skitty every now and again, but you know that's what happens because, you know, we don't live in a perfect world. That's all I'm saying. But anyway, let's get on with this video, okay? All right. All right, let me share the products I'll be using today on my Freestyle Poly Gel Nail Tips. I'm going in with McCart Poly Gel. This is natural pink. Okay. I also will be using this glitter that came in a grab bag from Daily Charms. And this is a very, very beautiful, beautiful glitter. I'll be using that in such a way. Don't know how my design is going to come out. So we're going to freestyle some things here, all right? I'm also going to go in using these here nail art. I believe I got these from AliExpress. I will leave the link if I can find it down in the description bar. But I'm going to go in and I'm going to go in using these here. But well, we're going to encapsulate these in such a way. And I'm also going to be going in using this here. These are some type of flakes that I received from AliExpress as well. I'm going to turn it over because I don't want to open the top. I don't want it to spill everywhere, all right? So I'm going to go in using these here in such a way. And I also want to try using these foils again. I used these foils in a previous video of mine. And I want to try to use them again, but I think I'll go in using the star shape this time. Okay. Now, I got this design all in my head, y'all. I don't know how well it's going to come out. If it come out looking good, y'all give me a thumbs up. If it come out looking bad, just keep your mouth shut and going on over to the next video. And just be like, mm-mm, Reese girl, not today, not today, baby. And I understand. Just don't give me no thumbs down. Well, you can if you want to. It don't matter, but you know why. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just tell me why you don't like it if you're going to give me a thumbs down. How about that? Be brave enough to do that. All right, let me stop playing with y'all for real. All right, y'all, I'm gonna get on with the boogie. I'm about to apply my nail tips real fast, and we're gonna get on with this design. All right, all right, y'all, in a minute. Okay, I already went in with one coat of the base. I'm gonna go in with a second coat for whatever reason. No really rhyme or reason why I'm doing this. I'm just doing it. You don't have to do it, but I do it this way. Only on my nail bed, then I'm gonna cure this here for 30 seconds. Okay. I'm using 70% alcohol as my slip solution. All right, now I'm gonna go in using my McCart brush and picker. So I'm gonna go in using a different gel brush instead of this brush. Just helps me apply my poly gel better own personal preference but you can still use that if you have it all right I'm gonna go in with my McCart natural pink poly gel and let's get started guys Thank you. 
So what I did was I cured it and I just left the little tacky stuff on there and just went straight on the head and added my my foil to the nail there. Okay? All right. Let's get on with the next part of the video. All right, look at here. This is where I just discovered I probably shouldn't have used that foil because that foil, because the alcohol I noticed done took away my foil here. So, like I say, this freestyle trial and error, trial and error. So, yeah, don't do that. Don't use the foil if you have to do this here design. Again, I say I got this glitter from a grab bag from Daily Charms. So, I don't know how they would sell this glitter. If they would sell it. Because it don't have the name on the bag here, but... It's just... Uh, Girl, this is a beautiful glitter here. Here, just sprinkle my glitter on here. That's pretty. That's pretty. Oh, isn't that pretty? All right, girl. Yeah, that's pretty. Alright, I cured that for 60 seconds. I'm going to go in and try and cap it with another layer of the pink.
we're gonna try something different. I'm gonna let this here dry, and then we're gonna try and go in on top with the foil this time. So that way we won't have to use any alcohol and mess up the whole pattern of the foil. <laughs> now the needles may look a little too busy, but hey, we freestyling, we maxing, we maxing out, all right? All right, it looked like it should have dried by now. So, I'm gonna go in with this, ooh. <laughs> Be careful, honey, because it will catch you. We're gonna go in with this for you. I'm hoping my camera is not blurry. All right, look at here. I'm going to go in and I'm going to try and just tap it on here. See what we can do. Uh, just get a little, just be a little extra. Oh, that's not pretty. Ah. see that girl that's pretty that is too cute we is doing the most with these nails today baby I don't even car I don't even call you <gasps> oh! <laughs> Isn't that pretty?
last and final step, I'm going in with Madam Glam Elixir. And also, I want to thank you. Big shout out to Miss B for suggesting that I do a McCart Poly Gel Nail Set. So this here set is for you. Thank you so very much for suggesting that. All right, guys. Here we go.